<laughs> My exhibition is called Mirror. It's on Davies Street in London. The Davies Street space I had seen before in the past, and every time my experience with it was always seeing it at night, walking down the street after dinner, after a drink or something, and, and that it looks like an aquarium. I wanted to make something that was scary at night. That was really my big goal, was that it wasn't joyful, it was dark and brooding, and that whatever it was there was looking back at you because you're looking at it. When COVID hit, I was thinking about religious images and how symbols have kind of transcended time, that you don't have to be Christian to understand the image of Mary with the, her dead son in her arms. And I was always interested in religion as a symbol, not as whatever message it's trying to say to its followers at the moment. I, I really believe that the thing that's important is to just bring people together with the same feelings that we all have. And during COVID, I was just kind of locked up like all of us, but I found it really kind of incredible how much it became about there'd be one person who'd be the caretaker, you know, and it was mostly the woman. And it really made me realize how hard it is in history for women to be artists because you can't do everything. You're sitting there taking care of everybody and cleaning and cooking and doing all this stuff. How are you going to daydream about making like a drawing that completely doesn't exist? And so that's what this new work is all about. It started with the Metal Storm piece because I was asked to be in a show about witches, actually. The theme was witches, and I've always loved Hans Baldwin Green, and I've always loved this particular drawing that he did of three women in, in a kind of sexy, scary, they're making fire and you could tell something bad or good's happening. And then witches have always symbolized the only women in Western civilization that are allowed to kind of be the doers, you know? They're the ones that can can make things, do things, and, and operate like a guy, you know? Well, the wood I've been working with for a long time. Wood is a very female material to me, and it's been something I've worked for so long with because it's malleable, it's, you can bend it, you can soak it, you can um, you know, easily cut it and make beautiful, beautiful shapes. With my sculpture, with the Metal Storm, it's also a positive and negative thing, which is about duality. So the flat planes, instead of it being completely a carved image, it's actually more of a built up image. So it's skeletal, comes from nothing, and then gets built versus a big hunk of something that gets carved down. So the negative spaces with the positive spaces with this sculpture really echo each other. I wanted it to then also have a reflection, which of course is mirrors, and I wanted to have the backgrounds of all the buildings reflect into the artwork so it becomes the inside outside again. The, the painting started already as an idea of mirror paintings. I've done them in the past, but I've never used the, the iconography of a religious symbol on the mirror until now. 